Hi guys, um, it's Bugsover10, and today I have a quick update, slash haul, slash cage door. Um, and yeah. And, um, something that a lot of people have asked me about. I'm missing something. No, no. Okay, never mind. So, here is Bugsy. Sorry, I'm moving the camera. I gotta get something. Um, here's Bugsy. <laughs> here's the food bag. It's dinner time. Wait, Bugs, it's dinner time. See, Mommy, I want my dinner. So here's his hay that he didn't eat today. He doesn't... Well, I got him these new treats. Now he's eating it. I got him these new treats and he's obsessed with them and he makes them last all day. And I got him a nibble ring. So, that's part of the haul. And I have four other items. So... Before I do the cage tour, I'm gonna do the haul and then I'll do updates. Um, so, first thing, uh, here's a new water bottle because we are getting a new guinea pig soon. So, I decided to get two water bottles for the cage. This is an eight ounce non drip water bottle. It hasn't dripped so far. I mean, the shaving, oh, the, yeah, it has. The shavings are wet under here. I have just haven't seen it drip. And you see, the shavings are all wet. They're wet, but it's not dripping at this moment. I wonder how it like. Yeah. Oh, he is very optimistic about it. And here's the old one. I still want to use this when we get our second guinea pig. It's just I need two um, water bottles for both of them. Um, the C and C cage update um, will come soon, I guess. Um, like later, maybe tomorrow. I don't know. I'm kind of tired right now. It's like midnight. Um, look at him. No, it's not midnight. What time is it? Oh, it's seven. It's seven. I'm tired. I woke up early. Um, I got him a treat kebab, which is hanging over there. And he is scared of the bell, so I had to take that off. And I have no clue where it is. Uh, today, I did get him new food. I got him the guinea pig advanced nutritional blend. Where is it? There it is. And this is filled with it. So, yeah. There's soybeans. There's lots of seeds. Um, so, and there's these flavored bits and bobs. And there's pellets in here. I don't like to give my piggy pellets because it's like the same old boring flavor for them every day. And like for dinner and breakfast, don't you guys have something different every day? Um, that's kind of how I feed my pig because he can kind of pick and choose what he likes because I know he doesn't like the orange bits, but he likes the red ones. So, that's what I like to do. And then, last, last but not least, nibble rings. He's obsessed. You're obsessed. Um, so, there's that. Now, I will do the cage tour. Um, so, here's the kitchen. Salt lick. Needs to be fixed. And I can stay there. His hay food bowl that I need to fill. It still has the tropical carnival food in it. And this is his new wall. So we can't knock any hay downstairs. It looks much cleaner now. So it's taped here. But the tape is non-toxic, animal safe. Um, and I only put like one strip print there. And that's it. And there's no tape here where he might chew. So there's his kebab, water bottle, that's eight ounces right now. Um, fruit and nut chew, that needs to be thrown away soon because it's bendy. And his old water bottle right here. And there he is. I don't have a lot of toys in the cage right now. There's back there, and it's gonna get clean tomorrow. So I will do an update tomorrow too. Okay, so now, I'm going to do, sorry, I'm really tired today. So now I'm going to do a um, kind of DIY on DIY do a DIY um, on how to how or like storage for food if you don't want to take out the big bag every day. So this is my storage. I have um, old food containers. They're it's Ginsler Gourmet and it's just a small container. It didn't last me very long. So I just used some of my food containers. So what I do is the lid is over there. Um, is 
this can be hard to do with one hand. So, I have a cup. I stick it in there. I'll squeeze the cup like this. And don't do it. Ew, it's spilling. It's spilled everywhere. I can't do this with one hand. So, again, fill it. And dump it. And. So this doesn't take me all the video. So I'll show you one more time. Or maybe two more. Yeah. So you scoop it. You squeeze it tight because you kind of want that little, a small little tip. If you have it like big like this, it's going to go everywhere. So you just to squeeze it. That one was a little too full. It's still spinning, even though I pinched it. It's still spinning. Okay, there's that one. So now I have a full container of that. So let me pick up. So Bugsy is doing very well. I haven't had a video up in a while. But I want to thank you for um, the views and everything because I would not have as many videos up if you aren't here, the viewers. So thank you. Oh, your salt looks down. Mm. Well, here's his dirty cage. It's going to be cleaned. He's so excited. He loves when I clean his cage. Okay, well, it's Bugsy's dinner time and he's getting very mad at me right now. He bit me because he wanted his dinner. But it wasn't dinner time. Um, CNC cage update will be up tomorrow. So I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye.